My name is uh, Don Wilcher. I'm the Director of Manufacturing Technology and also I'm one of the uh, full-time instructors here at the Manufacturing Technology Building. Uh, at the Manufacturing Technology Building we have several degree options and certificates. There's seven in, in, in total. So we have uh, industrial electronics, we have uh, manufacturing system technology, automotive automated manufacturing, we also have uh, computer uh, design and drafting, we have welding technology, and we have uh, uh, welding technology. So within those seven degree options, there's a lot of what I call um, well, learners, where they can play in the sandbox and, and attain skills and, and, and competencies that our industry partners are, are looking for. So uh, with that, I'm going to do, I got some nice cool toys that we use in, in our lab. We're in our uh, electromechanical lab. And I'm just going to kind of point to these guys, do a little demo, and, and show you where these classes that we have, just give you a little snippet of the classes that you will learn these skills that are very necessary for, uh, for industry. So I'm going to start with, with this guy because I'm really proud of this. We have, uh, as you can see, we've got a virtual reality headset. And we just received these guys. And this headset is going to be used to teach what's called our Mechanical Systems 1 course. And with that course, you can get a certification. It's the uh, Manufacturing Standard Skills Console. We call it MSSC for short. Uh, credential and maintenance awareness. So with this particular uh, technology, the, the, you guys will be able to be immersed in a virtual world where you'll understand how mechanical systems work, also the control panels that uh, are, are used to operate, say, the motor drives. And also, the way it's set up virtually, the lab is just like what you'll see in, in the physical lab. So I'll be immersed in that world with you and there's an avatar, I believe his name is Sam, <laughs> and he will be providing some instruction, technical assistance. Of course, I'll be there to, to facilitate that, that knowledge. So I'm really excited about this technology. And again, a lot of companies, not only in, in uh, the Birmingham area, but outside of Birmingham, they're really focusing on virtual reality for training and uh, augmentation of, of uh, like repairing systems. So we have a nice headset here. Also, uh, another class where you will learn how to use instruments, this is a digital multimeter. We have two classes called uh, circuits, it's circuits one, and we have circuits two. Circuits one deals with what we call direct current applications. Like, when you talk about direct current, like batteries, okay, or low current circuits, you'll learn about resistors and, and how they are used to uh, create a whole bunch of applications. One is like sensors that are being used in industrial applications. So you learn how to use this multimeter, it's a digital multimeter, and it's multi because you can measure current, voltage, and resistance, and you'll become, uh, as I call it, a ninja in, in using this. This is one of the key tools that a technician would use out of the industry if they're working on automation systems. Okay, so that's one item here. Uh, behind this, in the suitcase, we have uh, another new uh, structural technology. This is our, our uh, PLC. Uh, as you can see, it's in a suitcase. Very convenient. I can take it out and, and do demonstrations. But this ties in with our uh, two PLC classes. It's the Intro to Programmable Logic Controllers and the Advanced Programmable Logic Controllers. So you can see here this little box. This is actually the brains of all automation systems. This is the programmable logic controller. It's the newest in the uh, PLC, call it product line. It's small, compact, and that's what it's called. It's called a compact logic. So you'll learn how to actually program this guy using a, uh, a graphical language called ladder logic. And with this trainer, or AKA a simulator, it has different buttons, and these buttons, along with uh, LED indicators, will represent the controls that are used in industry, you know, like you're talking about palletizing machines that basically can wrap products, uh, you got conveyors. So those devices have electromechanical sensors or electronic sensors. That's what this trainer will allow you to become familiar with in terms of the operation, writing the ladder logic, and also doing the diagnostics. And as, as an instructor, I can put faults in here 
which will help in your troubleshooting uh, endeavors. Over here, this is a gigantic touch screen. It's no different like what's on your smartphone. It's called a human machine interface. So what they're doing in industry is they're replacing the electromechanical push buttons with touch screens because of environmental um, concerns like with these guys, a period of time the contacts start to wear because you're actually pressing down metal to metal. This is done electronically, so again, the longevity is, is longer compared to what you see here. But you'll learn how to program uh, an HMI and the uh, PLC courses. And then the last thing I want to talk about is uh, this little guy right here. This is also a little computer. It's a uh, what we call a little micro bit. And on the back, it has uh, a little brain. The little brain is, is right there. And that's no different than what you see with the actual PLC. So the technology is uh, becoming very small. And you'll learn how to program uh, little digital circuits. And those circuits are being used to make smart sensors. So this represents, I call it a little analog clock that one of my students programmed uh, using a, a graphical programming language. And you can see here it's just you know, showing 369 in terms of the, uh, the rotating hand. But if I, uh, let's see if I can get this right here. If I press the two buttons here, let me get it this right. If I press the two buttons, it's creating a little logic gate circuit. So what happens is it, it should show like a, a little smiley face when it, there it is, when it completes the cycle. Okay. So now you, in that class, and I, I'm using this for the intro robotics, also um, digital electronics, and I actually use this with my circuits class too introduce the, the concepts of sensors and, and, and circuits. So uh, there's a online simulator that's free. You'll learn how to use that to actually model the program and then you can test it here. And then of course you've got a little road map where you can actually take the wiring diagram that you created and you can transfer it to the actual uh, physical uh, uh, prototyping unit here. So a lot of skills that you'll be learning uh, I like it, you know, I'm an electrical engineer, I, every time I come in this lab or our robotics lab, I have a good time with, with my learners and, you know, it's a journey, so it's a partnership, you know, I'm, I'm the advisor too for the program and I will guide you on your journey as you obtain these skills and, and knowledge that will benefit uh, you, your family, and also uh, just, you know, have fun learning. So. That's it. Look forward to seeing you, um, talking to you about the program in, in person, and uh, everyone have a great day. Thank you.